So, you know, we're on the one who crushed Tyler. Crying, yeah. When they cry, episode 18. Rika. So cool. <laughs> but I, I was like, of course she's evil. I, I don't know, but I, I, I said it earlier. I, was like, I don't trust this little old you Sam. She's probably hiding her true. Um, but certainly it felt that even before they revealed in the ending that someone was helping her. And someone was like, but you have to stay with me forever in this world. Forever! Uh, and, uh, you know, it made sense that there would be such a cool. Just like, don't you love me? Don't you want to be me forever? She's full on dunder, yeah, something like that. Anyway, let's start watching it. That's what happens. So, three, two, one, and go. But yeah, this is one more time traveler. Maybe even more than one. And I guess Satako is then the. She's not possessed, right, by the maggot, by the serum thing, the syringe thing. She's actually used by the disease. She actually is used another time traveler, something. How do you get outside, though? What? I guess it's not a flashback, I guess. With her being evil. With the nurse being evil. I guess it's not a flashback with her. No, yeah, drops her. She's really badly explaining this thing now. She, we saw it last week too that she's actually evil and in that life, in that. Yeah, Takano, that was. But she was always suspicious anyway. I mean, she was incredibly suspicious. But that's a weird trick we see her with her gun. <laughs> Come on, anime. And that sense is there. Her grandfather's here, but who's her grandfather then? Okay. This seems to be suspicious. He's like, let me take her. But then the other girl is there too. You know what I'm saying? It was the other girl, the other time travel girl. Yeah, what? He's here lying here because she's evil anyway. Yeah, they're like, wait, maybe you lied to us. <laughs> you seem to be lying, Joe. So you're doing the, so you're doing the next question thing. So I, I don't know, man. It's like, but this, I guess, this has to be an order path. But and then the girls here too. It's really weird, anime. It's getting really more and more confusing <laughs> for a, for an anime only because then the older girl is over there too, right? The other like, the other thing. Hmm. She's standing there next to uh, in the court and side or so. Who would believe this guy? He's, he's, she's clearly like, oh, I love this man. She's clearly like, I love. Oh. I mean, why would you believe him for a second there? If he's, why would this one like with him? This is like absurdly stupid. Like, okay, yeah, let's just leave. Yeah, let's just leave all of us immediately. Yeah, okay, you're right, you're right. Oh man, that looked ridiculous. <laughs> they all left. Those guys just left him with her. But also, I wonder why she's there. That is really weird. Why it's like another woman there. Or I mean, why, why is she inside of the... But it's really a weird episode now, it feels like I missed an episode. It ended last week right with, in the school and now it's like another life worship, another memory of Rika or something. It's just like... Yeah, like another... Like what I'm watching, you know? What happened with last arc? Now we're here, is it missed an episode? <laughs> it's like, what? She's like, did I miss an episode? <laughs> she's out of the blue to again see another pop with her being evil. And it was really stupid that they left him with Beauter. They were like, yeah, you can keep her. Like, we, whatever. We, we trust you, man. You're clearly not lying. It doesn't even do your obvious job. Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Well. I know they just leave you like in a romantic. Yeah, but like, which way is who shot here, bro? Yeah, I was like, what? <laughs> this is this is completely it makes sense as ever. So she's also in their time too. I mean, I, I guess if you played watch all the anime, play the game or something, this would make sense or something. Because I don't even know how she can be there. Previously, she's only been in the you know between the time, right? 
Han Yushan. Yeah, it looks like my Yushan, but. We will always be together, right? Of course we will. Uh, I guess he promised there to her or something, and then Hanju left something. This is weird, Hanju is out. I mean, yeah, Satako is there now. What's happening? I guess it's like uh, the whole reboot not being a reboot, it's actually a sequel. I guess you have to, I suppose, watch the older season to understand why Hanju is there or something. It's really his confusion of me. Like, how did she get there? Um, and then I guess she sounds like a promise there with, with Rika. I don't know, I mean, I don't mind it being like, there's some reference and hints or so on to the previous season, right, with the games or whatever. But, I don't know, it's, like, last episode clearly was, the first half was like, what are these cops things, what is thing? And I mean, it's one thing if they explain the cops, they didn't, they didn't explain anything, it was like, oh, it's cops, it was, you know, yeah. Just expositioning some information there. And also how many here too fits in a similar way, I mean, it's like, a little bit I feel, um, No, that, that seems weird to me. That seems really weird, honestly. Um, got hard to follow. Last episode was worse. We had all those more characters. And then this huge amount of... Last episode was weird at that time, because there was just so many explanations at the same time. Oh, well, this guy's a copy. This guy's also a copy. Yeah, but just, just give a lot of hints. It was like reveal twist, files in a row, right? The fact that could be probably better eased into it as um and only for this element. Um and what's happening? Well, the last episode ended with her with the gun. It's not over here yet. I'm almost like I'm watching the wrong episode, but now it's like older it's like also. It's an older at the I guess I'm gonna explain what happens in the older time or other universe or whatever. When they're older and going to school. But it's like... Yeah, so do you have to see Muon sound loading, okay. Yeah, but clearly Santa Claus is way older. This is really confusing. <laughs> I guess this is like when they're older, it's the motor place? Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, but Satako looks very different. She looks very different. Um, Rika looks older too, but Satako, Sat I think. Bon, yeah. Okay. They look about the same, the other girls. The Kenichi, so he looks about exactly the same. It's not different there. And Rina the same as one. This is building up the whole, wanna make food for me? It's <laughs> better the first orc, you wanna make some food? Oh, <laughs> indeed. Yeah, oh, pathetic. This is his food. Let's <laughs> keep thinking his food. This is like a Kenichi. <laughs> Kenichi, Kenichi, if you see a Kenichi. But then I have to, have to eat faster than his master because he always eats food, right? <laughs> like he has to fight his uh, martial art master by eating his food all the time. Yeah, like that. that's life at the martial arts school. Hmm. No! Which best girl? But yeah, of course this village doesn't have high, doesn't have like that kind of. Hmm, of course in a game club. Hmm. This feeds out of the blue this whole story arc, <laughs> like a year later or something and. I mean, yeah, I mean, but I guess, I guess he's gonna betray her, or at least she feels betrayed, right? 
Det är lite så att det går att betray dig igen. That's why she's like, I will make you be stuck in technology. I mean, likely little Lord Yo will feel betrayed, and, and that's why they get in here, right? Somehow, in this version. That's why Rika gets stuck in the thing. I guess. See, you see, when he's one worse than they did, but he survived, of course. Uh, so they still playing games, of course. They still playing board games and. Get some cute new girls to play, yeah, you know, life is much on this. It's wholesome, it's just people are his friends, it's just a nice anime. Oh, I see, the next festival. <laughs> uh oh, another festival, not here. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh shit, or nix. Yeah, we have to shit though. There's no like uh, stuff on it. Yeah, I need to be. Yeah, yeah, high head patter. Please, <laughs> I'm actually really good at this game. I mean, yes, I always shit, but I am actually a good player when I have to play. I guess he's gonna get crushed by any children or something. It's gonna. After Goshan will clearly be defeated by everyone. She's really bad at memory. That's not that cool. Couldn't even get a single pair! She really said at memory! How can she then memory how much Rika betrayed her? How she has a memory of that though? She really has such memory. Okay, Rika to leave. Oh no. But I feel like I'm watching like another season or something. Like how how do I get here? Is this the right episode? Is it episode 18? Is it supposed to be here? This anime is it feels convoluted. Convoluted indeed. I mean it's like where am I right? But I mean, I guess it's gonna lead to her betraying, or at least something will think to betray, right? Hmm. The holes too wholesome. Yeah, it's this weird, man. Where's all the blood and gore? Too wholesome for me. I need to be more brutal. Jinx is gonna help here. Yeah, those beloved people. Oh, they're jealous. Stealing your friends. Yeah, I want a sheet though. It's like you should hone your traps. You should hone your sheet skills. Yes, excellent idea. I will improve my sheet skills and traps and so on. Yes. Oh, 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 oh indeed. I like this. I have to just improve my skills. Yes, yes, yes. God, Yuri. She betrayed her love interest. That's why she. I see. I see. Supposed to be my wife. No, I get it. No, I don't get it. <laughs> I'm just like, I don't get it. No, I'm not waiting for it to. No, I'm just. <laughs> yeah, what about the maid outfit? Damn, this sense is almost like. What's about that uh, sexy maid outfit? Come on, man. We saw the broad that episode. 
So the brother being some kind of coma, like an induced medical coma or something. Okay. I stopped giving her a shot. Okay, but maybe that's a mistake, right? Maybe that's a yeah, backstabbing mistake there to stop giving her uh, medicine. She's cured. I mean, I feel not really like. Honto, you I'm cured. Yeah, this seems too easy, right? I doubt it. Yeah, it's like oh, you're cured, no problem. You won't ever end up uh, me murdering your friends again. It won't ever happen again unless it does happen. <laughs> it's like okay, yeah, you know, because but it is weird in this anime that it's both like mad. I mean, it's clearly ma magic, right? They have whatever. Dimensional travel and demons and shit, uh, and also it's medicine. It's also technology. So it's like a weird mixture of both being science and not being science. Yeah, everyone is improving. Okay, this sounds <laughs> more magical than than science. That everyone is suddenly cured. Really, everyone? Ah, oh, yeah, interesting. Oh, I have Vakaran eye. I'm a Sajiti girl. <laughs> it's an instant girl. I don't know anything. <laughs> it's like, sure, Rick, I sure. A certain someone will. Yeah. Oh yeah, so Baba is back, good. Old uh, demon lady is back. Hmm. Old lady has changed. <laughs> just tell her what, yeah, the old lady is like, just tell me what, what you want, girl. Yeah, the old lady has not changed at all, right? She's the same. The lady gonna say no again? No. It's like whatever. Yeah, she's kind of uh, bullish as always. Doesn't want to do it. The bullheaded woman. Hmm. But now what? Yeah, the next festival, then, right? So now we went around the loop here. We um, clearly in the fire festival as well. I guess you can die here instead then. And like, I guess you can die here, right? And just be the same thing anyway. Like I guess last week or two weeks ago, when I was like, if you die, it probably goes back to the original year, right? So it's like, uh, this seems like we've seen this before, <laughs> but not so. We've seen this before, but other years. We've seen this before, but other years. Um. Hmm. I mean, I guess we'll just take control side. Right? This might be seen as a massive betrayal for Sata Cross of I think Sata is a betrayal. Right? Oh, what should I do? Oh, what does he want? It's a damn war. <laughs> yeah. Damn that war. The damn war. Come on. Um, I still don't get how, uh, how at all this fits into what happened this episode, right? With Satako. Unless Satako was her parents were killed with the damn thing. So I guess this will trigger her somehow. This just has to lead to a Satako tr 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 triggering, right? Just like, mm, I guess I do agree. <laughs> mm. 
basically. So the, you know, yeah, the she's not expunged anymore, right? She's not. I mean, this sounds good for her, but maybe it isn't somehow. Maybe somehow this isn't good for her. Maybe somehow you know it's gonna be like. Hmm. But somehow it's gonna affect, of course, her friend here, and then they'll be traveling back in time or whatever. Hmm. This is like a really good ending here. Yeah, not that wind can change and everything is perfect, or is it? Right? This feels like. Man, that was really weird to watch, man. Did I watch the whole episode? There's like a few minutes. There's only one minute left here now. Um, there's only one minute left here, so I guess it has to be some kind of cliffhanger, betrayal, or something, right? Something has to happen, right? Like now here, it's like. Something to happen, right? I mean, something, something to happen, something negative to happen. It has something has to happen here, right? It's like a really weird episode. She's gonna leave the city though, so that's gonna trigger her, I guess. Because she's gonna, I'm leaving the city. I'm leaving. Yeah, I have dreamt for a long time, long, long time, many lifetimes to go to this academia, sadly. Oh, she was gonna go with her though. Maybe, maybe she should stay in school. Now you're all dead then because something will fail at school or something. But it feels like a really weird uh, man, the episode feels so weird. Like what am I watching? Yeah, you know, like I miss an episode in between something. But I guess it is will lead to her obviously to explain why she hang at her. She tried to leave the city, right? She had to leave the village. And obviously she's gonna like fail the next time, I guess, and, and then Um You know she faced the exam and after she faced the exam or whatever, right? Or you should maybe she wouldn't do the sand, but she triggered by she heard leaving her or whatever. And that explains why she gets stuck in the time or whatever, right? I suppose so. Sataco is also Sataco was angry when she left her, right? And put her in these things. That's what makes sense, right? That Sataco is a trivial since given last episode. But this episode really didn't explore that much more. Yeah, this episode felt kinda of slow because I didn't really explore that. Like it, it basically could have started with her being like, I'm going to this school. Like the, 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 uh, the build-up for that was felt pretty pointless. It's like the build-up for her just being, I don't know. I guess just to point out that everything was fine. Everything was, they were all cured and so on. And then uh, Rika betrayed her, so it was big, I guess. <laughs> but it felt like really slow, to, because they didn't even see her snap at her, right? They didn't even get into the real thing. And also, I was confused to seeing um, who shone here in the... And all the time and so on. So it felt like a really weird episode. It felt like a very weird episode. But yeah, honestly, for me, it felt slow paced then. It was just there to. It was just there to like explain why she hated Rika or something. Why she betrayed her. <laughs> like. Yeah, because what was that ended with her? With the gun and. And then another episode with her. And <laughs> I was like. What did I just see? <laughs> I was like. Uh, nani, na nani, na nani, na nani. <laughs> Seriously, this is very confusing. Like this is this is goddamn confusing. This episode, and I mean it's not confusing. I mean I understand 
where I think I understand what it's going to, right? Like Rika's gonna leave the village, they will trigger Sadako and she will then curse or whatever to be in this new time loop. That seems pretty obvious, and that's that this is then probably definitely a sequel, right? So I guess what we're seeing here is kind of the result of them winning in the first anime, I suppose. And now we see what happened then. The Sadako got triggered and, you know, made her back into uh, the time loop. So this is pretty clear. In that sense, very clear. But I have to say, I mean, obviously I'm still a little bit here, haven't seen the whole thing yet. But it does, to me, feel slow paced though. Because it's like, what is the point here? The point here is to explain why Satako is angry at her, right? And the last minute is like, I'm leaving to go to this uh, academia, right? And that's not the last minute, so that could have been the first minute, basically. <laughs> like, yeah, like, what was, what's the point of everything else? I guess the other thing is to point out that they're all happy now, and everything is going fine and so on. Maybe. I don't know. It felt that could have been given uh, given out faster, right? So that's a strange episode. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, it feels really out of place though. I mean, you do really want to see the continuation. And I think a problem definitely is also that it's very clear, right? That uh, Tomoko, the nurse, that the cult leader, that she is quite important uh, in the season one aspect, right? But here for me, She's been, of course, in the anime. We saw her going into the Arara, the place of traps. Yeah, we seen her being a very, I would say, obviously evil character earlier, very suspiciously evil. But they haven't explained her story at all. Her grandfather's paperwork or something. They haven't really explained her dealing at all, right? I guess she's the main bad guy in, in first season. I suppose. I suppose she's the first. I guess she's the main bad guy, right? This is the one. Then that that that's my guess, right? Again, not having seen. The older version, right? So that is really strange, but yeah, the first minute is there for me as an anime only for this anime. It's like, uh, okay, and then he saves her, yeah, okay, and then that's the other guy, this is there, whatever, weird, and okay, and like, so it is a. Uh, now, now I feel it definitely is kind of losing me, right? Uh, massively. And I don't reach really losing me as I'm just I'm confused of what's happening, more it's losing me. Honestly, from like a watching aspect, right? Because I'm a little bit like, man, I'm not. Earlier in the anime, I didn't feel like I had to see. When I watched the first arc or second arc, whatever, right? I didn't feel I had to have no prior knowledge to the first season. I didn't, I didn't feel that, oh, I'm missing out because I haven't seen season one, right? Of course, I didn't get all the reference, whatever, but I, I didn't feel like I was missing out. I didn't feel that it, like, in that sense, right? I felt I could watch it. But now, no, this episode, especially in this episode two, it really does feel like, man, now I don't, I don't feel they're building it up very well anymore. <laughs> you know what I mean? I mean, it's like, man, I, I need some more meat on uh, Takano. I need some more meat on my honey hands there. And I need some more meat on this cops thing and the medicine and this thing, right? And the brother. So it's not, now I'm starting to feel like, okay, now it's hard to uh, enjoy it to some extent. I'm not saying that oh, this is the worst thing ever. I'm just saying that. Nah, this reveals now, especially the last bit that reveal, it didn't really work that well not having any prior knowledge right to the cop thing. Yeah, it didn't really work that well. And then he's kind of explained it very, very quickly. Bam, bam, bam. Didn't really, didn't really like with detail. It's kind of bam, 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 and that's over. And, and now I feel a little bit like, okay. And then he's, here it felt really slow pieces. Here, here I would prefer them explaining more with the music or whatever. So it's just like, oh, everyone's happy. And then she probably left school. Like, it felt like a really slow episode. Like he could, he could have spent more exposition, more explanation in those details. They have, like for example, they could have explained, you know, Taka, yeah, the evil cult woman, in whatever her character is. I suppose it's an evil cult. Leader. I'm just guessing, but yeah, like that could have been explained. I think more in detail here. So that, uh, but just whatever is explored. That. <laughs> so so now it feels like they really expect me to have seen the first season to really get, enjoy it at the full, you know. Um, so it is just strange to me. Starting to get a little strange, definitely. From like an enjoyment aspect, mostly. Um, something like that. Definitely. It's a weird episode now. I, mean, yeah, I would say again that this episode seems to be like a straight up sequel, right? To how the last one ended, with my guess, the last anime season ended. This will be like a sequel to that. And obviously, for me, there isn't alone. It's a little bit like, yeah, I kind of want to see. You know, I, I kind of want to see this first um, season, I suppose. Not just me, but I mean, I think in general, right? It's getting harder and harder to enjoy it if it's... It's just a thing, right? From any kind of anime, not just anime, but like if it's... Yeah, so now it, now it is definitely like a sequel, and of course then it's much more like... 
if I haven't seen the uh, season one, obviously I'm gonna get weirded out by season two, right? So, but that wasn't that was not in my you know in the first as I mentioned when I watched the first ten episodes or whatever, right? that didn't feel like that. It felt like obviously I'm not understanding every reference and so on, but it works. But now I'm starting to feel like okay, now they're relying too much on me having seen season one or played the games or whatever, which I haven't, which I haven't done, right? So I'm just being, so I'm a little bit also disappointed. It's a little bit like man, now it's really hard to I feel and just enjoy it also. It's more like, uh, it's, it's sort of the, it's sort of the reason to lose me out, yeah, okay, I don't know. Uh, but anyway, that's the review, I mean, it's, you know, that's me, I'm honest, right? I'm not saying it's the worst anime ever, but I do feel now that they, they are, in my opinion, it feels like they are relying too much on the viewer having seen the previous season, right? Which didn't do earlier, so it just feels like I'm so much stuff I don't understand. I, I don't know, basically. Understand is the wrong word, I mean, I understand what they're saying, right? It's more like I don't, I don't have the information, yeah, it's more like, I'm, I understand what they're saying, but I feel there's so much for me as the viewer. I have to kind of, uh, you know, just do a lot of assumptions. I guess she's the leader. I guess this thing. Yeah, there's so much I have to assume, which I don't know, right? Uh, and that works in the as a mystery thriller anime. Of course, there is a lot of guesswork and mystery and so on in general. So that's that's fine. But but now I feel like it seems like I probably should know this stuff, right? I mean, like earlier it's like hmm. I probably shouldn't know this yet. This is a confusing, you know, interesting, yeah. But now it's like I probably should know her backstory completely, but they completely omitted that in this in this season. So I'm like, I don't know what she's doing here. <laughs> it's a little bit like that, right? So I'm like, eh, okay, her grandpa, who's that, you know? Uh, but anyway, that's uh, that's the reaction, guys. Press that subscribe to the right. Arrive. We're almost at five thousand. I'm gonna say every video now, five thousand, baby. No, no, but really, I mean. Uh, you know, getting any kind of milestone, right? Uh, whatever you do, YouTube, Twitter, whatever, right? Twitch, whatever. So it's nice getting that that, that nice figure, right? Same, same like a salary, going from like a I don't know, thirty-seven thousand to forty thousand. Oh man, that forty it feels really. You're know, getting into that four or right? whatever, right? Yeah. Uh, same thing, of course, with YouTube. Yeah, like getting to five thousand subscribers would feel great for me, of course. Ah, then I'm at five thousand, right? Yeah, like oh man, it's nice. You know, getting like a halfway through the next digit kind of thing and so on right hopefully but whatever uh, this is like a nice feeling i think I and mean, you almost yeah, turned the most happy now so it's pretty nice i think it can be done this week honestly if we keep on the same track here last week i think it was 106 i think last week so um but um, yeah subscribe guys please subscribe yeah no i, I usually don't i was like please subscribe but, 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 I, but i do feel it now yeah, honestly i feel a lot more now right it, it's like a funny thing it's kind of like how to say it right um if I had, you know, let's say 4,137 subscribers, getting 30 more, 30 more, I mean, it's nice, but it's not like, oh, that's like a milestone. Yeah, it's like, oh, it's nice. It's nice. You don't subscribe. I love you, love me. But of course, now it's like, oh, you get 30, 40 more, and then we get to the next milestone. Of course, that feels a lot more like, well, that's like an actual. Uh, I think 5,000, honestly, in my opinion, is pretty good for like a normal, uh, you know, not doing it, doing it after work and so on, not full time and so on. Uh, you, 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 I'm doing YouTube mostly for fun, right? Yeah. Um, five thousand is a lot. It means like I'm like. It's, it sounds it sounds easy to say, but I think if you have one of a thousand subscribers, I think you are bigger than like ninety nine percent of the channel or something, because there's so many like zero subscribing channels. I mean, like in total value, it's like you're in the one percent <laughs> already. I think after like thousand subscribers, something like that. It's just really weird. But now I'm just laughing because it means that how many actual channels exist right there's so many people on youtube and other kind of systems that it's just um just so many millions of people that have like zero subscribers <laughs> they just you know made a channel no videos but it's still a channel right technically so it's like a massive it is i'm in one in the one percent boy uh but anyway uh see you guys in the next queen tablet coming up after this and then of course promise neverland